Did someone die or something? Oh, not really. Nobody died. If nobody died, then why is blood everywhere? Oh, they had watermelons, but those didn't survive. Watermelons, huh? Alright, we are here today checking out a little banger by the name of Demon Pact Gladius. This is something that's been suggested for me to check out, and this is something that's completely free for you guys as well, so I'll have a link for you down below. You can indeed support the developer on a Patreon, which I'll also have linked down below, but it's a completely free game otherwise. It seemed very intriguing. It's about two hopeless nerds that summon a sexy demon girl, and uh, unfortunately for them, this demon girl requires a sacrifice of their lives. But obviously they don't want to die, so the entire mission then becomes to find somebody to kill, sacrifice, in order for them to get a wish from this sexy demon girl. This is a mature theme game. Some terrible crap happens in the story. It's my responsibility to warn. If you're easily disturbed, or have any type of mental health problems, then please consider not playing it for now. now that's actually a serious thing. Like, if there's any sort of issues, guys, for sure don't watch this. But, the other lighter side of me wants to say, I think you're kind of already used to the content that I make in the channel, so I don't think anything here should really be too surprising to us at this point, so... Okay, sure. Don't forget this is a work of fiction. Please take care, and have a nice playthrough. Well, that's nice. Secret code. Do you know any secret code? I have not even a clue what you're speaking about. So we have a, a fairly um, in, intriguing looking character here as we start off, but I have a question about this character in particular, and probably the majority that we'll see here. I will pose this question to you guys later. Right now, let's actually get through the introduction first. Dude, you know, I like you and all. But Zack, did you really have to make a demonic pentagram in the middle of my room? What the fuck, bro? Trust me for once. After I summon the devil, he will do anything I want, including cleaning. Also, think about it. What if the devil is a girl? Just like the specific hentai I read once. Trust me. So we're not even a minute into the game already. We have a mention of hentai. I think we know where this game is going. Sometime later. Uh, it is indeed a pentagram. We have a couple of sixes there. We seem to have um, the cherries that you see in casino slot machines and another pentagram just for good measure. Dude, this is not working. Oh, really? No crap. Y you meant to say no shit, right? Come on, you know I don't swear. Oh, but apparently it has worked. Oh, now he's uh, swearing as well. Holy fucking shitting balls. Oh, it worked! Oh, f for the first time in my life, something works! Hmm. It's been 50 years since the last time I was summoned, huh? I am Rachel, a demon. Thanks for summoning me back. As a token of my gratitude, you can make any wish, little boy. Uh, just one? Yes, but I shall take your soul right after. This is a joke, right? Ah, oh, you almost got me. Oh, this is my chance to redeem myself and change the rest of my life. The ultimate wish. Can you be my girlfriend? Ah, oh, these two look fun. I want to play with them for a while. Oh, so that's your wish. Why don't you wish to be immortal or something? Uh... But this is love at first sight! I already love someone else. I'm sorry, but I can't be your girlfriend. Oh, of course this happened. You made your wish anyway, though. Now it's my turn to eat your soul. Choice. Oh, we have, a, we have a choice, as you can see. The story can and will change depending on your decisions. Choose wisely. Choo choo. Choose wisely. Okay, so find any excuse or fight for your soul. I'm not much of a fighter. I don't think these guys are much of fighters. Let's go ahead and see if we can find any excuse here. Okay, here, here's the catch. I, I, I already gave my soul to another person. Y you didn't. I can see in your eyes. Uh, yeah, dude, I'm pretty sure your soul is still there. Sh shut up, Lenny! Uh, well, what if... What if I get a soul from another person? I will be free again, right? 
Hmm. Yes. Oh, let's go, Lenny. There's only one person that can save our asses. Who? Uh, your depressed artist dude friend. Trust me, I have a plan. Uh, she's a girl, not a dude. Oh, come on. Girls don't draw the shit your friend draws. Well, what is that supposed to mean? Chapter 1, Soul Search. Find another soul to be taken instead of yours. Do you mean she draws lewd images? Oh, believe me, there's a lot of female lewd artists out there. Okay, so here's my question that I wanted to start off the video with as we got to the introduction. What is the difference between furry and anthropomorphic, and is there a difference? I played Black Sad as a one-shot on the channel not too long ago. And that was apparently, I was told, an anthropomorphic comic series that we played as a game. But then there's certain other things that are called furry. I don't know the difference. Like, I'm not familiar with it. So I would like to know what is considered furry and what is considered anthropomorphic. These are all just things I'm very curious about. Now, you're shining here very brightly, so I think obviously we need to choose you. Contact list has been found. Uh, how do you even use this? Yeah, it's sticking in a D&D book, I guess. Lenny equips the contact list. Like, have I equipped it as a weapon or something, or what? Yes! Hey, that's my sister's room. We cannot go in without her permission. I don't care. Yeah, I know, I see a shiny in there and I want it. Female clothes have been found. Wait, why would you ever pick that? Yo, this is a better stats. Maybe I should equip this. Really? For real? Oh. Well, we have, um... We've turned Lenny into a femboy right off the bat, apparently. Wait. Did someone die or something? Oh, not really. Nobody died. So, were they sent to a hospital in time? Oh, not really. Nobody got hurt. <laughs> Alright. If nobody died, then why is blood everywhere? Oh, they had watermelons, but those didn't survive. How did she do that? Uh, magic? Of course. Okay, but can you explain what happened? Uh, not really, we're still investigating. Please don't touch anything and follow the law. Alright. Watermelons, huh? Why is there a chalk outline too? It's just trash? There's probably nothing interesting in there. Oh, but is there not really? Look into the trash? I hope this doesn't have a negative impact, but I'm the type of guy when he plays RPG games, I'm clicking on everything. So we will look in there. I'm a dirty bastard and we got five, um, garbage. Um, you guys are apparently standing there like you want to fight me. We have a fight coming up, don't we? Holding a bat in a very menacing manner. Hey, dick face. Where do you think you're going? Uh, good morning, thank you. We're going out to the city today to visit a friend. I also see David back there. You two always together, huh? You implying something? Uh, you said you two are gay. I did not say that. Maybe you didn't notice that yet. Somebody is dressing like a girl. Well, at least the game takes into consideration that's the case, so I like that. And that's not me, dumbass. Now, moving on. Today's Wednesday. Losers cannot leave Nerd City today, remember? Wednesday? Oh, snap. Why did it have to be today? But why are Wednesdays so important? Today is role-playing day. I want to stay home and play some RPG with my friends. So, you are breaking our deal? Can I devour your soul now? Oh, n never mind. No role playing today. Hey, how did she do that? Um, magic? Of course. Look, long story short, you shall not pass. Alright. Confront or wimp out? Uh, we will confront, I suppose. Uh, Lenny, we have support. Heals a little. Restores health to the whole team, including you. And special, we have distract. <laughs> with our dress, apparently. 
Distract a character is deal less damage. Sounds good. And procrastinate. Distract yourself. This move is dumb. Don't want to do that. Ultimate. Salvation. Heals everyone to basically full health. It's never too late to try again. Alright, let's start off with a bit of a distraction here. Uh, Nick seems to be the guy I should worry about with that bat, maybe? Zachariah, what are you gonna do for me? Procrastinate, don't like that. Deep Rage, not yet. Fight. Try hitting them, I guess. Struggle, and big struggle. Make a mess, hits every enemy on screen. Try hitting them, I guess. Let's just struggle on Nick. Oh, wait a second. Hmm? Y you don't have any attack option. Yeah, it's not a single damage dealing move. Dude, how are you supposed to win if you don't ever attack? Uh, I thought you would attack, not me. Are you fucking shitting me? Good luck. So, I mean, can I can I somewhat make a little bit of a comparison to Lisa here? Like the the very I don't know the the meta ness the the moves having certain names, self awareness, maybe a little. Nick can't take it anymore. Nick is down. All right, so one dude is down. Uh, I guess we'll probably even go ahead and not heal at this point, but let me try. I already distracted him once, but you know what? Let's save our MP at this point. Can we just do a help? Sure. Let's do the special or the ultimate, because that's going to be TP. 44, that's what's up. We survived. We got $8 reduce. Okay, you win. Wow, congratulations. But before we go, we have something to say. We don't forgive, we don't forget, we are nerds, but we are everywhere. You guys are not the heroes here. You're a bunch of nerds just like us. You don't even have any baseball bats. Everybody knows main characters have them. I mean, he's not Ness, okay? Hey dude, let, let me ask you something. Just say it. Why are you so passive? Healing is useless. If the enemy keeps beating us, they'll win eventually. Why don't you just smash them instead? I can't even imagine myself hurting another person. Uh, just have in mind that someday, you will have to kill or die. I'll leave this job for you, I'm sorry. Lenny learns support. Mm-hmm. Ominous words. Who are you? Uh, I guess you're a bat. Woman. Carlos, stop! Hey, pretty nice fight back there. Yeah, we rock. Can you please be my girlfriend? No. Uh, what's up, Anita? Usually don't go outside all at all. <laughs> Cause she's a bad? Uh, just chillin' for now. But I wanna get out of the city just like you. Wait, how did you know that? Uh, Nerd City has like 10 people living inside, so of course, news spreads very fast. Did you hear the latest news, though? There's some weird conspiracy going on here. Some say we are not nerds, and this city is actually a prison to hold us from society. But only on Wednesdays, though. For whatever reason. Don't know why. Uh, such a weird and specific thing, so of course it is true, right? And if anyone ever tries to escape, they get straight up murdered. So my plan is, I will hang out with you guys and help you out. If they catch us, you can use me as a distraction and a meat shield and sneak out. I don't trust this girl, Lenny. But damn, she is hot. Shut up. Then if I get outside, I want to make my business and get rich selling garbage I find in a trash. Oh, sure, go ahead. Nice, let's do this. I need to join your team. I gotta tell you, I'm actually liking this a lot. Uh, it's it's very unique. Uh, again, it does it does have that that Lisa type of charm. Li li the library is here. Hey, dude, do you remember me? I'm Duster, the card master. Wanna play some cards? Uh, sure, why not? Uh, not really. We... He uses some ultra-rare, very powerful monsters. It's no fun. Oh, no. Uh, never mind, I wanna go home. My turn, I summon Green Eyes Great Dragon. I also activate... <laughs> activate Pot of Cupidity. It allows me to draw two cards. No, no, the Pot of Greed has been banned. Exactly. Now I special summon two summon skeletons. Everyone over 99,990 attack combined. I attack and I win. Shit, he destroyed me before I draw my first card. What even is this game? Bitch ass children's card game for kids. I'll just let him be. 
Hey, it's the library. Oh, uh, yes, I know. And you want to come in? To read? Mm, that's the point, right? Matthias. Alright. Give a look to any book you want. You can also take them with you, since nobody gives a crap about them anymore. Uh, you know, it's the digital age, right? I could just go ahead and um, have a million books in my iPad. You found a book called... Book 7. Book 7, really? This name is bland as fuck. Shh. Once you get all of them, it'll be easier to organize them. Books 5 to 8 will teach you how to play this game. If you ever get stuck in a fight and keep losing, please consider reading them. To get good scrub? <laughs> Thank you. Apparently you can do something if you have enough scrolls. Okay, well now I've learned about that. <laughs> uh, why can I only find books 5 to 8? Is this a joke? I can't start reading from the first this way. That's so unbelievable. Again, I actually want to talk to everybody in this game. Monk, congratulations for finding a secret place. Uh, this place is not secret at all. This place is in the middle of the city, and it's pretty big. As a reward, I want to show you the path to the low blow skill. It deals triple damage against men. You know what? I will also give you a justice blow. <laughs> I mean, I don't even know you that well, dude, but sure. It is not fair, it is a fair and square move, so don't worry about hitting anyone's spell sack. Wait, does this move hit right in the chest of the target? Yes, pretty fair, is it? No, this hits right in the tits. This move does stray girls. No. Okay, that's fair enough, right? Oh, I have to beat you for this move. Well, I... wasn't quite ready for that. We did save, so there is that, I suppose. <laughs> Alright, well, let's start off here with the old dude. Uh, gives some motivation to an ally, motivated characters to deal more damage. Yes. Let's start off, though, with the distraction first. And Zack, don't want that. We gotta wait for that ultimate, so do a struggle. And Anita, wanted to be a meat shield. Gamble, cast a random magic spell, effects unknown. Random events may happen. Consumes trash. Okay. Throw oil. Makes one enemy covered in oil. <gasps> Yo, that was one of my favorite um combos in Lisa. Oil them up and then fire them up, boys. Makes one enemy wet. Please don't take this out of context. <laughs> I already have. Um, okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. What do we do? What do we do? Let's try recycle first, just for the hell of it. Anita is recycling. You find a piece of paper in the trash. There's a number written on it, you make a call. Man, this is unique as all hell, I like this. What is... What? I gotta tell you, I'm, I'm liking this a lot, this is completely unique. Hello, God itself here. What do you want? Oh. Um, I would like power, maybe, for this fight? So do you want to be stronger? What if you stop fighting like a nerd? Done. All struggle attacks were replaced by just attack. That's how it should be. Goodbye, my planet needs me. Goodbye, God. Ow? Okay. Well, now we have attack as opposed to struggle. That sounds amazing, I, I guess. Um, let's support Zachariah. And now Zach has attack! A real moved! Yo! Okay. And, uh, yeah, what else do I do? Let's gamble, I guess. Zach is motivated. Anita's gambling. Throws a thunderbolt for 19. 45 damage! Another thunder, but hey, we beat him! Ha <laughs> ha! Got five, and we'll get the attacks too, right? You got the low justice blow skill, and also one item as a proof. Zack can use the skill now. By the way, if you had a character, they might also have the skill. Don't forget to use this for the greater good, little kid. You can come back anytime if you want to practice your new skills. I'm gonna wrap it up here for this one. This has been Demon Pact Clarice. And so far, this is actually really, really freaking good. Like, everything about this is unique. I already made the comparison, I won't do it again. But it's fairly freaking unique, man. Free game, as I've mentioned, I'll have a link for you guys down below in case you want to check it out for yourselves. Otherwise, you could also um, support the developer. Definitely, um, definitely worth it, I would say. Especially for free game. Very unique. If you guys want to see some more, you know what to do. 